You know, I, I'm a big fan of bait and switch. Um, I, I like lure fishing. Lure fishing is great to some point. Uh, certain parts of the world, you know, it's, it's great to bait and switch because there's a lot of fish out there. Um, you know, when we're when we're bait and switch, I like having four teasers and one hook down the middle. You know, just kind of a safety. The fish doesn't tease up and he fades off. There's something back there with a hook in it. Um, that's the way I like to fish. Um, it's great for the anglers. It's great for the mates. Everybody's involved. Uh, you know, we're, uh, you know, I like kind of a big spread, you know, you, know, you want to spread all your stuff out. Um, you know, I like a couple squid chains with a couple mackerels, a couple lures in the, in, the, in, the, in the riggers, you know, farther back, and then one lure or a bait with a hook in it down the middle. Um, just, you know, for that one fish that fades off and doesn't want the teaser and you have something in the back kind of, you know, as a backup. We fish our dredges about 80 feet behind the boat. Uh, you know, every boat's different. Bigger boats have more wake, and sometimes we like to drop them back a little farther. Smaller boats have less wake, white water, so we you know, we might fish them a little closer. 80 feet, you know, round about um, third or fourth wave, maybe uh, off the back of the boat. We count waves that come off the back of the boat. Um, I like to fish my teaser behind the dredge uh, a couple waves. Um, you know, the, the dredge is kind of a uh, you know a it's a teaser, but uh, it's it's kind of there to resemble a school of bait fish. Uh, the fish generally does not, I mean he does, the fish will come to the, the dredge. Um, a lot of times you won't see them on the dredge, but the dredge kind of brings them up. Uh, the teaser is behind the dredge a couple waves. I like my teasers back, um, you know, fifth, sixth wave, um, you know, uh, that's our favorite spot. That's where you want the fish to come. You know, fish comes to the teaser, hit the dredge, comes in, you know, tease the fish in. Other than that, we have two long rigger teasers behind that. Um, you know, keep them spread out, you know, another five or six ways behind that, you know, another uh, 150 yards behind that, your other teasers, and then way down the middle, you know, right down the center, way back, and a, a bait with a hook in or a lure with a hook in it, you know, just as a backup.